So, what's going on guys? Andy here with Cut and Clean Lawn Care. And right now I have an awesome shadow transition on me from my apple tree in the front yard. I feel like Arnold Schwarzenegger from the movie Predator, just getting ready to pounce. but I'm not getting ready to pounce. I'm getting ready to mow. Today I just got the Gravely and that's all I'm taking. I have four properties compared to the six or seven I would usually have on a Friday. Uh, two of them for sure have uh, texted me and said don't bother mowing this week, mow next week. One of them's having a roof replaced today. Uh, the other one's just yards real crispy and starting to burn out. We're not getting any rain here in Missouri, so that's something we really, really need to get into. But I'm gonna stop and take another second and talk about the equipment defender racks. I've been getting a lot of love and a lot of hate from these. I mean, it's not my product. I honestly don't care what you guys think. I enjoy them as a person using them. That's all I really care about. Uh, if you guys are interested in these, man, check out the links in the description. You guys will be able to check that product out there. I'm a fan of them, but you know what I came from before, so you guys know why I would be a fan of them. Uh, backpack blower, a lot of people say it's gonna be more of a headache doing this. It's really not. You pop this lock out, pull this up, backpack blower comes out. What's the big deal about that? Having all this stuff in the back of my truck was more of a headache. Even though I'd run a strap across, I'd hit my brakes sometimes because there's bad drivers out there, you know, and everything flies towards the front of the truck and it's worse for me getting my fat butt in the back of my truck. So yeah, I'm a big fan of this. Uh, something I did uh, for you guys that know me as well as you do know me, I like to make everything my own. I'm a big fan of modifications and customizing stuff. Uh, I think I've already told you I cut all these down six inches. That way it'd be a little lower for me. Something else I did is I took some JB Weld epoxy, which you're not getting into any of these screws on this system. If you are worried about theft, they explain that in the instructions if you're worried about it. I really wasn't even worried about it. I just wanted to do it because it was kind of a option in there. But the only JB Weld cover obviously I could find was black. So I went ahead and shot these all black. They were red. I don't really know if I like the red better or the black better, but either way. There's just like the trimmer rack, there's more black on the trimmer racks than there is red. So now it kind of contrasts and matches a little better. Who cares? Who needs to be that picky, right? I guess I do. Uh, yeah, I mean, I like it a lot, man. It's saving me a lot of stress of having to pull that stuff out. The motor mounts are awesome. They hold the stuff up really easy. And just like I said, it's really easy. Boom, put your combination and turn it, unlatch it, got them off. But like I was saying, you get a lot of hate because there's, there's, there's fans of everything. So I'm getting all the green touch fans that are like, this is stupid, they stole the idea, blah, blah, blah. That's not for me to determine. What's, what it is for me to determine is the fact that they presented these to me to try them and give my feedback to them as a company. And that's what I'm doing. And while I'm doing that, I'm enjoying using this product. I, I think it's great and it's going to work great for me. Will it work great for you? I don't know. But like I said, if you want to check them out, check the links in the description. Go browse through the stuff and see if it's something that would work for you if you're interested in buying trimmer racks or blower racks or any stuff like that but you guys know me i'm not a brand specific person I, I i i don't care as long as it works for me and what i'm doing i'm going to use it until it doesn't work anymore until i need something different so yeah i mean i appreciate all your guys' opinions that's awesome i'm glad you guys all have an opinion but you got to understand like when you're when you're coming to me with the green touches better stuff i don't care just because it's a name brand, I don't care. I'm just here to try it out and see if I like it and give them any feedback on things I think they should change. That's all I'm doing, man. But yeah, like I said, guys, a whopping four today. That's impressive, right? We need rain bad, so let's go get into it, man. I 
feel paralyzed See guys, and I'll take more than just the backpack blower with me. Sometimes it's just unnecessary to have to throw that over your back all the time for some of these small properties. I'll just take the DeWalt, slap a battery in it, and use that when I don't feel like throwing on my backpack blower. So sometimes it's good to have something I guess around. See, so why would I waste the struggles of throwing my backpack blower on for something like that? just finished up with property number three and it is very very dry and crispy it's extremely dry and they're talking about high 90s this weekend and still no rain in the forecast so that's awesome uh, I got one more to do so I'll be done pretty early today which is awesome uh, you know, spend a little more time with my son you know what's what's wrong with that uh, that's about it man but I'm gonna see if I can't film this next one I'm trying to think of some new angles, new places to put something, either my GoPro or this camera. We'll come up with something, we'll see what happens. So let's head to the last one, man, get it done and call this a day.
right guys, I'm back. I just finished those properties. I'm all done. Hopefully I got you guys some kind of entertaining footage. And, you know, typical me, I changed my mind again. I went ahead and repainted these the true red color. I don't know. I'm one of those people that like fidget spinners were made for. I can't stop messing with stuff. So I got these all painted back. It looks good. I think, I, I, I think it looks better red. So that's it. That's all. I can't, I can't leave stuff alone, man. You guys know that. So thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. If you're interested in the racks, check out the links in the description. And I'll see you guys in the next one.